Okay. Okay. A fighter. Nice fish. Ooh, nice fish. Easy release. See you later. Welcome back to the channel, one and all. Fishbrain Shane here, and I'm telling you right now, I'm gonna get on the crappies tonight. Might even get into some big ones, not sure. But I'm back in the single man flip shack. Why don't you join me? I'm gonna keep this short. Let's get the music going. You ready? <gasps> there it is. Let's go fishing, let's go fishing, let's go fishing now. He's at about 10 feet. He's coming up. Here he comes. Hope he's got some size to him. The end of the pole is just shaking. It's my first fish, so I'm always, you know, you get out to a spot, even when you get a vexilar like this, and you can see the fish, and you can kind of get above them, and you can move your mark, you know, jig, get them excited, right? Um, but I'm always nervous that first time out or that first fish, I guess. I'm nervous because A, I'm hoping that there's some big fish here and B, I'm really hoping that I catch fish. <laughs> you know, you, you drag all this stuff out here, you get all set up, you get ready to go and you'd like to uh, be successful. You know what I mean? Oh, there's some success right away. Whew. Oh, that's a good sized fish. Not too bad to start the night. I mean, in a giant, but I'll take them. Pretty little fish. Bit the minnow, bit the jig. I still got a nice jig on from one of the last times I was out here. So what a nice fish. We're gonna put him back first one of the night. So he'll make the show. See you later, buddy. Okay, so what I'm gonna do tonight, and I just, I wanted to kind of search for him. Um, I'm basically gonna use one hole. And I am going to go into my bag of tricks here. I got some really cool stuff. But one of my favorite things that I like to use, you know what? I think I might even have it up here. Let me look for it. One of my favorite things that I like to use is the Gulp Alive Fish Fry. It's one inch and it's the pink. The pink and the white seem to work best for me. They also make a chartreuse and you know that I like that chartreuse color. But this pink on the ice really is kind of a sentimental favorite, if nothing else for me. So we're gonna try that pink. So what I do, I'm taking a jalapeno jig with a loop knot that's tied into it. Um, and I've got a nice ultralight pole with a whip tip. So I'm gonna take this little plastic gulp and I'm gonna hook it on here as natural as I possibly can. And I like to take this bend in the tail and make sure that it's pointing up. I know that's kind of specific, but I think that that helps. So I'm gonna run it on the, on the jig, pop out the end, and then when it hangs down, you see it's gonna kinda of hang a little bit sideways like that, and as I move it, that tail's just gonna go crazy. So let's see if we can get some fish in, interested. Let's get down there and get after them. All right, there's a big one right there. This is gonna drop down nicely to it right away. See that big one? We're gonna see if he's interested in the gulp. He's coming up right away. An immediate reaction. Immediate reaction to the, ooh, there's a nice little fighter right there too. Oh, he's getting wrapped around my thing. Wrapped around my deal. Ain't that big, but. I do want to see him. There he is. Yeah, I'll get that unraveled in a moment. Yeah, not a bad little fish. Pretty good uh, color on him, the nice purple in him, you can probably see. I'm gonna put him back. See you later, buddy. First one on the, uh, on the gulf. One thing I can tell you, if you're new to ice fishing, is make sure you get tungsten jigs. You're gonna be tempted to buy lead jigs because they're inexpensive and they come in packs of multiples. Um, but I'm telling you right now, 
as far as getting down to the fish and being bit more often that you cannot beat the tungsten jig it's absolutely fire absolutely fire for real here comes one up to it right now let's see if we can get him interested oh that was an upbite that's a better fish it's a little better fish right there ladies and gentlemen let's get that one up and show it off oh yeah he choked it look at that one that's a nice slab right there Whew. didn't choke it too bad look at that and he's got one of my minnows in his mouth wow i might have dumped one down the hole and he got it look at that what a nice fish that's a beautiful crappie right there beautiful purple going through it just a beautiful fish that was a fun fight right there do you see the pole bend on that thing <laughs> let's go ahead and get him back we'll see you later buddy bye bye well this gulp is going to be my go-to bait tonight this uh pink fry man it's the deal yeah <laughs> i'm pretty excited about this this is fun it's one of my as i've told you before on my other videos this is one of my favorite things to do right here ice fish i love ice fishing with my friends but there's something about going in that single man shack and just drilling them you know what i'm saying just getting after them yeah that's a nice fish right there little guy thick something about it everybody i just love it if you could see my face right now <laughs> i'd be smiling as wide as this guy hello hello i'm a smiler see you later fella get back down the hole okay you guys i see a big mark right there let's go down and get it look at that big mark hopefully that's a big fish and not just a couple small ones let's see i'm gonna creep in on them all right we're just above him he's acting interested here he comes. Got him. I don't even know how I saw that bite. Ah, it's just a tiny little guy. Look at that big mark turns into that. It's a nothing. You're a nothing. See you later, buddy. Got him. They're trying to pull this move on the bite tonight. It's crazy. They're not really biting it hard. They're just kind of putting it on it and uh, pulling a little bit of a move. I don't know what to say about it. It's it's a weird bite, but I've got it figured out and triggered. So we're gonna get it. See you later, buddy. Yeah, I'm not sure about the size of this one. I'm fighting good. Yeah, it's a decent sized fish. It's a good little fish starting to increase in size a good little bit pretty fish we're gonna put them back see you later buddy splashing up all that water all right I'm going down to this group down here the top groups have had some smaller fish in them so what I've been doing is just working multiple levels of groups and seeing where some of these bigger fish are here comes one I hope it's bigger Feels like a good fish. Uh, no, maybe it doesn't. It's too bad. It's not too bad. I like you. It's just not the size I'm looking for. See ya. We're losing some of our marks here. And I had to switch to an alternative light. So, might have to get one or two and get the heck out of here, ladies and gentlemen. Got a good mark right there. Let's see if I can get him pursuing. Looks like I can. Got him. He ain't a big fish, but he's a fish. Still getting some numbers. Just looking for that one more big one. <laughs> Aren't we all? <laughs> This pink taily guy is just crushing them tonight. I haven't even had to put on a minnow. It's just been one fish after another. 
and uh, I think based on the size of the marks I'm seeing that it's just a little bit smaller crappies in these schools that I'm fishing tonight and that is okay with me I'm not keeping fish tonight at all and uh, I'm just trying to have some fun you know I got the small poles out got the gulp minnows on I'm just reeling in fish I don't know how many I've caught tonight I mean it's dozens I've caught so far <laughs> see you later fella get down there and try to get some with some size here come on big crappies come on come on big crappies come on so you go find another group of fish you want them to come up and bite it and then you take a stab at him see if you can get a nice one out of that group fight him in nice mm -hmm. oh yeah <laughs> Come here, don't get away now. That is a fat chunk of a fish right there. Right there, right there. Nice. Nice. Nice fish. Man. Just a beauty. Chunky, thick fish. Again, I've got enough fish in the freezer. So, this one's going to go back. But what a pretty one. Goodness. See you later. Well, you guys, it's been a fun evening of fishing. I've only used one, just one of these gulp pink fry minnows. Minnow fries? I don't know what they're called. Fish fry. <laughs> I've only used one of them. Talk about economical, <laughs> right? I mean, I've caught a ton of fish. I've had a lot of fun and I've used about... I don't know what was it for the jar $5.99 and I used one of them and I think there's I don't know, 100 150 of those little things in there who knows it's a ton of fun these fish have been all over it I get down near those marks and they just grab on I'm telling you what a fun evening it's been a lot of smaller fish which is absolutely fine this guy's spiking me a little. Um, I've had my light go down a little bit, but it's been a wonderful evening. Thanks for joining me on this episode of uh, Fish Brain Shane. I appreciate every single thing that uh, you do by just watching, liking, commenting, doing all the things you normally do. So um, for me and for this little crappie guy right here, Fish Brain Shane out.